Hey guys, it's me Sonic and welcome back to our channel which is Sonic and Shuffles World and in today's video we are going to be showing you guys the Fitzwilliam Museum and this is part 1 uh, which is Egypt part so yeah and the other parts are coming because this museum it was really big and we had to make several parts for this and a really cool fact that in this museum in this part in the Egypt part all of the things are actually from Egypt and some of them might be inside from of the actual pyramids as well so let's find out about it and all of these things has like all of writings beside it about the facts of it like where is it found or like who made them or something like that oh my gosh it's so cool i feel like i'm actually in egypt right now inside the pyramids like wow oh my gosh guys this museum is in the trumping Jordan street okay and and there's like a big it's like really big if you go there you cannot miss it okay because like it's really big and something about this museum you can like um take pictures and videos but you cannot turn on flash because that might damage all the things okay and look oh my gosh coffins and they have like so cool drawings in there Wow, and that's the cover of it. Wow. My gosh. And so, yeah, as you saw that we accidentally turned on the flash. So, it's, yeah, you get the fact, right? And, ooh, those look so cool. Wow. Oh my gosh. Wow, it's really cool. It makes me, you know, like in movies and everything, they show them like these are inside the pyramids and stuff. So it makes me feel like I'm actually inside the pyramid. Wow. And everything, like there's like a little bit of writing about everything. So like you get to know about what it is or like why is it there or like what is it about or why is it. How is it used or something or who made it or like where is it found etc like information about that thing so which is really cool right wow and this museum is open every day except for Monday and every day it's open from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. and then Sunday it's open from 12 p.m. to 5 p.m. okay guys please come here if you have time like this museum is so cool Wow. Oh my gosh. <laughs> wow, so cool. Ooh, are those ne is that a necklace? Are those jewelries that they used to use? Oh, that's interesting. It's like a animal thingy sculpture, but you can put things inside it. Ooh, the fish thing. We saw that thing in the archaeology and the anthropology museum. They use it to put like a kind of eyeliner in their eye. But we couldn't film in that museum, so we cannot post anything about it. But we saw that, like, kind of the same thing in the another museum. Like, wow. This is so far. That is my favorite museum, like, that I've been in my whole entire life. Like, this is so cool. Wow. It's a carnelian, carnelian necklace. It's about 3000 BC. Wow, that's ancient. That's old. Wow. <laughs> oh my gosh, guys. So cool. 
Wow. Guys, in here they found a skeleton of a child in there. It says right here. creepy guys why would they find a skeleton of a child in there what did they do with the skeleton of a child oh my oh my gosh i think some of them are like kind of destroyed like they couldn't find the whole thing or might it's it just might be how it is like wow and like in in Egypt, they have like a whole different alphabet that I feel like doesn't even look like letters. It's just symbol and like symbols and like pictures and stuff. Like their alphabet has eyes and like different types of other things on them. And I do not understand what that the what's that what that means. Like look at this. Like in their writings, it looks so cool. But at the same time, it doesn't look like a writing as this, like as well. Like for me, it looks like kind of like a um symbols, like you know what I mean. Ooh, I think it's like a program or something like a party. Ooh, they're cutting a cow. It's kind of like the what they do, I guess, like their culture. Ooh, that looks that looks cool. I I feel like that's something they like kind of live in or something. I guess. Wow, like in ancient Egypt, they're like so so talented. Like, I don't understand how could they make they make these like nice sculptures and everything. And I still don't get how they make the pyramid. Made the pyramid. Like, oh my gosh, that's so big. But like, you know. Like a lot of there's like a lot of theories behind it, but I don't know which one to believe. Wow! Oh, like look, if they painted this by themselves, I have a question. Where did they find paint? Like, what did they paint with? Like paint? They didn't. I'm pretty sure they didn't have paint brushes or like something like that. Did they shuffle? No. Yeah. So like, how did they paint? Like, what? That doesn't make any sense. Ooh, is that a real human? Um, I hope not. Because, like, in there, it says that some of the mummies are real. Ooh, are those, like, insects that are found inside the pyramid or something? Wow, it's so cool. Ooh, that's so cool. Like, oh my gosh. Look at those. Like, wow. Like, oh my gosh, how did they do them? Like, is it like, are these like actually from inside the pyramid? Like, cause like when we watch the movies that has pyramids on them, they show that inside the pyramids there's these kinds of things. So I feel like they they found these things actually inside the pyramid. They went inside the pyramid somehow. I don't know. Oh, Egyptian writing. There's like some writings in there. I think so. Like they're sometimes hard to distinguish between if it's like a writing or a picture, it, cause like. Oh my gosh, a real mummy. It says that it's a belonging of an official named for who is the prophet of Amun. That. Oh. What's that? That is something. That's the Archie's mummy cage. Okay. Thank you. 
picture, isn't it? Wooden mirror. That's a human mirror. Seven number key as a package to the family. It's a million people, real million. Or the person. Oh my god, is this like real people? Or like from Egypt or something? Wow. So cool. Wow, they look so 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 cool. Ooh, that's a snake, right? That's like a snake picture kind of thing. Like it's it's so cool. Like as in the stone they carved like a snake sculpture thingy. Wow, like they're so talented. Wow, looks so cool. Ooh, like in this coffin, the picture they look like they look really cool. Like I don't know why they they have to like you know paint pictures inside coffins, cause like you cannot see inside the coffin after like you put a mummy inside it. But like they know why they did it. I don't know. I have so many questions I wanted to ask if I see, like, if I saw, like, someone ancient from Egypt. Ooh, that's like a small pyramid. Looks like a tiny pyramid. And these are, like, small parts of pyramids, I guess? I don't know. I sh let me check the writing. Ooh, look at those. Those look really colorful. They look really good. Wow. It looks so cool. Oh my gosh. Look at those. Did they do they used to use those stuff to like drink water or something? Look, granite sarcophagus. What? Is there like an actual mummy inside it? It's so big, like it's bigger than the other coffins. Like wow, it's so much bigger. Ooh, look, there's like a sculpture pin painting type of thing of a woman. Wow. Like, did I, I like? Do they used to like sculpt everywhere they? they could like and like look what is this is this like a storage kind of thing or something what is this oh <laughs> at first I thought it was like a storage thing you could put those thing in like <laughs> oh my gosh look oh my gosh, wait, I kind of have like a theory, like it's my own, I made that, don't, I might be wrong, like, I feel like Egyptian people were like really, really tall or something, like, you've seen like some body parts and something, like, look, 
oh my gosh, look at this, that's just its lips, like, look at it, it and, the, like, a part of the nose, and it's so big, then their, their face might be really big, and they might be really tall, and if they're really tall, they might be really strong and something, and that's how they pick up, like, the big rocks of the pyramid, like, that's what I think, guys, what do you guys think, comment down below, like, what, how do you think they made the pyramid or something, like, that's what I think, like, Comment down below if you agree or if you disagree, comment down below what you guys think how pyramid is made. Like, that's what I think, like, if there were, like, the mouth, if that's, like, a mouth of a real person or, like, if the, those times a person's mouth were, like, that big, then their face might be really big. Like, look at this. And if their face is really, really big, that there's a possibility that they're, they are also really big and they're also really tall. And if they're tall, they're, like, also really strong. And if they're strong, they can pick up those heavy rocks of pyramids and stuff, and that's how they make they made the pyramid like though that big. And if they're tall, then they might have really tall ladders as well to climb up those ladders to make like to put like the tallest rock. Yeah, that's my theory, guys. Comment down below if you agree or not. Uh, comment down below if you dis if you disagree. Comment on what do you think. Ooh, well, look at this. It's like a, I think it's like on those holes you put a string and you like hang them up somewhere or something like that. I don't know. Ooh, like, oh, beside the coffin, there's like lots of drawings and stuff that you didn't recognize that fir at first. Like, wow. Okay guys, that's it for today's video. Don't forget to smash that subscribe button, turn on notification bell, and wait for other parts. Okay guys, bye-bye. See you in the next video.